Hello YouTube, this is Captain 85 Kurt. Dude, this is Captain 85 Kurt. Um, this is Captain 85 Kurt. Um, this is Captain 85 Kurt. 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 Dude, this is Captain 85 Kurt. 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 What's up YouTube? We got a bunch of game pickups and uh, console pickups for y'all for uh, this video. Um, one thing to start out with is uh, at Goodwill, they had a Super Nintendo that was sitting in uh, the shelf for a long time and it was like $40. Um, anyways, I needed one so I can, you know, sell it to one of my buddies. And so I went to go ahead and buy it and asked if they would go any lower and it went down to um, 30 or 25 or something like that. Anyways, this is it right here. This cover right here is actually uh, not the same one that came with it. I already switched it. Uh, the only problem is it kind of plays, but it doesn't. So it's kind of messed up. I'll put Mario World in there, and Mario wouldn't show up for some reason. So um, it was got that for 25, 30 bucks. It came with all the hookups. Um, it came with another AV connection, so it came with the RF and then the AV. So you got all that for like 25, 30 bucks. Um, I don't really remember. It doesn't work. Oh well. Um, I can always try to switch it out with something else later on. I'll find another Super Nintendo and get credit for it or something like that. But uh, at another Goodwill, I got these right here. I got about eight games. I spent about uh, another like $25 on them. You got Star Fox 64 and James Bond 007 GoldenEye. Mario Tennis right there. Pretty good. See Mario Kart 64. Pretty good copy. Uh, Tony Hawk Pro Skater. This one did have a label on the front, and then label, of course, is still back there. I'm going to try to get that off later. Um, and then NFL Blitz has a bunch of marker on it, so whatever. But it also has another little sticker right there. Uh, Wayne Gretzky 3D Hockey. Pretty good copy. And Madden Football 64. So I got all eight of those games right there for about $25. Um, not bad right there. I'll probably just uh, put one with the N64 and sell that and make some money so I'll buy some more games or, you know, pay bills. So, and then I'm not sure if I showed this in the past video, but I actually got a Pokemon Yellow for the Game Boy. Um, I didn't really recheck, but anyways, um, at the same Goodwill, I got the um, Pokemon Yellow. I uh, found a bunch of PlayStation games. Half of them were found one day and another was about a week later. Um, anyways, let's start out with, got right here, Mega Man Legends right there. Uh, it's the green label, you know, greatest hits. Has the manual and CD right there, all in really great condition. I looked these games up on eBay and uh, actually going for a lot. And then, let's see here, we got Mega Man 2, or Mega Man Legends 2. This one right here is actually the rare one. For some reason, but uh, there you go. Really great condition. Manual uh, game disc is really great. I mean, it's like it's hardly played with. Um, but this is the black label, so this this is really a good find. Let alone you know, Mega Man Legends uh, one on the uh, greatest hits. Now, also in that same lot, I found Mega Man Eight. Really great condition. Greatest hits. Uh, disc is the same way. But there you go. So I'll probably keep Mega Man 8 and I'll sell off the Mega Man Legends ones so I can try to pay back, you know, because I owe rent and stuff like that and I was like, well, I'm going to go ahead and buy it. And okay, on another day, actually yesterday, I found this Death Trap um, Dungeon, disc, manual, everything, really great condition. Um, I got that just because it's actually not a bad looking game. You may look it up on gameplay, but it's pretty cool. And also... Duke Nukem Time to Kill. Once again, really great condition. Manual disc. Very awesome. Uh, both of these are black labels, so no, never really hurt going and getting these discs right there. Now, Savers, um, got Tekken 3, but the game, see that right there? See that broken piece of tip? Uh, no, messed up. Um, the game was selling for like three dollars, but I got them to go down to uh, three, not three, 
um, to a dollar. So I just wanted the case and manual and stuff because everything else is good and the game wasn't oh well. But so it's me for a dollar and I was like, ah, whatever. Might as well just go ahead and get it. Now, I um, also went to the garage yesterday and the guy said he had a bunch of Nintendos. Um, and so I found this one right here. Got some Game Boys and other stuff, but it's pretty dirty. Had a game in it. Um, Mario Brothers right there. But there you go. I didn't have a power plug. Um, I did happen to find a RF adapter. Let's see what else I got here. Here's one of those turbo controllers. I already have about two or three of these, so if anybody wants to trade for this or just buy one, um, then you know, go ahead and let me know. Just leave me a message there at the bottom, or just you know, give me a PM. Um, also, that Nintendo, like I said, I grabbed an RF adapter I found in a box. Not the exact Nintendo brand, but uh, you know, it works. So I got that right there. I have plenty of plugs. Like I said, anytime you find plugs for any old systems, go ahead and buy them. Because um, you never know when you find a console with no connections. So, the Nintendo, um, and actually, and those two controllers, and then the RF adapter, plus Sonic Spinball, the little handheld uh, gaming systems from back in the early 90s and 80s. What does it say? 1990, Tiger Electronics. Uh, I saw this too, so I decided to go ahead and get it. Um, got that with the Nintendo, the two controllers, and the RF for a... Uh, ten dollars total so I'll go ahead and fix Nintendo up you know put a bunch of games with it and uh, go ahead and sell that and so that way I have more uh, more of a budget when I'm buying games for myself or just buying games to resell to, uh, that's about it actually and I will have another video up of uh, GameStop um, dumpster dives so um, seen that a couple people have been doing that so I went to go ahead and check it out and I found a lot of cool stuff so Alright guys, thanks for watching. Make sure you uh, comment, um, give a thumbs up if you like the finds, and take it easy.